You might remember that we also imported a few plants from Megascans earlier and we haven't used those yet. So this is what we want to look at next. Obviously these plants are also simple geometry with like nice textures, so you could just grab them and drop them into your scene as how you did with all the other assets. But we also want to have a look at the foliage tool, which is Unreal Engine's tool to help you create like natural environments really quickly. But before we look at that, I just want to throw in a few of these. As we're getting closer to our final result, I took the liberty to adjust the lighting a little bit. I'll turn them on one by one and mention a few things that I changed. First of all, the key light, which sits above our scene, uh, I changed its scale quite a lot and moved it more to the left, just so that it throws a light onto the left side of the rock and doesn't spill over to the right. Then I decreased the size of the rim light and made its angle quite a bit sharper, so it creates a nice amount of detail and contrast on this side of the rock. Then I decreased the intensity of this bounce light, as I found it confusing how it was creating two light directions on these objects. I also created an additional light that lives on the back of the scene and doesn't affect the objects in front of it. It basically just throws a light onto the background and therefore gives me more control over the brightness of the background color. 